there is Lewis Hamilton right behind Mick Schumacher. But is Mick Schumacher starting to struggle on his tyres a bit? And it's Hamilton trying to dive down the inside at turn eight. What a place to make an overtake. Don't often see it there. Hamilton back up ahead of the Haas. Pretty unorthodox, but very effective there for Lewis Hamilton. And then Mick Schumacher tried to hang it around the outside. But Lewis then starting to find a bit of grip and a bit of confidence. away with Pierre Gasly through turn eight. That was very close indeed. Got himself ahead of Pierre Gasly from 10th now up into 9th. I saw it, Sunshine. Lovely work from Sebastian Vettel into turn one, allowed Pierre Gasly to go a little bit deeper and then got him with the old switcheroo uh, on the return. No good getting older if you don't get wiser. And uh, yeah, very, very nice move there from Seb. But look at this. He's got two queuing up behind him here. There's three abreast as the Alpha Tauri of Gasly retakes the advantage over Sebastian Vettel and the Alpine of Ocon <laughs> goes round the outside and says, thank you very much indeed, I'll have that. That was awesome. Head down, crack on. This is good, mate. Crack on. Esteban Ocon is making amends for Daniel Ricciardo's uh, little squabble with the Williams of Nicholas Latifi. He's got past Ricciardo and he's going to try and get past Latifi in the space of about 200 metres. And he's done just that. Beautiful. Well done. Here comes Fernando Alonso with Daniel Ricciardo right behind him and right into the path of Esteban Ocon. Uh, we've seen the two Alpines get a little bit uh, tasty in this race so far and Alonso ahead of his teammate but for how much longer he goes wide Alonso that could allow Ricciardo to slip down the inside. Ocon hampers Alonso's progress. Daniel Ricciardo picks off both of them during the course of a couple of corners. Probably stuff Daniel, good work, good work. He wants to be left alone to do what he can do best and what he can do very well is produce some overtakes from a long way back. Look at the bouncing on the Ferrari. The Red Bull's coming at him. Verstappen goes round the outside into the chicane, stays on the track. Max Verstappen takes the lead at the sprint here in Imola and we've had passes for the lead in a sprint for the first time, the first sprint of 2022. And I hope they're all like this. This is epic. Goes Charles Leclerc on Max Verstappen. Oh, and did that catch Max Verstappen napping a little bit because he certainly wasn't expecting Charles Leclerc to come down the inside. That was a brilliant move. You were never going to frighten Max Verstappen off the road by darting about in his mirrors, but he certainly left the door open and Leclerc walked straight through it. Brilliant car control from Charles Leclerc to keep that Ferrari late on the braking, diving down the inside within the track limits. 